Hello crafty friends, it's Brenda from Stamping with the Copper Cropper. I'm an independent stamping up demonstrator. I hope you enjoy watching today's quick tip video. Hello everybody, today's quick tip is on which type of ink to use when. Last week we talked about Versamark watermark stamp ink and stamping up classic water-based dye ink. If you'd like to know when to use these, just check out video number 11. Today, we're going to talk about when you would need Memento or Stazon ink. Stazon is a solvent ink. It's a permanent ink. Once it dries, it will not smudge or smear, and it can be used on a variety of surfaces. You can do things like stamp on this tile, color it and then use a sealant on it to make a nice coaster. You can stamp on the clear window sheets or vellum. In this case I stamped a mason jar on the window sheet and then I used my heat tool to dry it because solvent based inks do take longer to dry. After that dried I cut that out and this is the card that I made with it. You can see that I made the clear mason jar which I then filled with the strawberries. This is a very versatile ink and it can be used on a lot of surfaces. However, the one time you would not use stays on ink is when you want to use alcohol ink markers. When you use alcohol ink with stays on, the combination of the solvent and the alcohol will bleed together and make a muddy mess. However, if you want to use Stamping Up's water base markers, Stays On Ink is the perfect match. When you're using the alcohol markers, you will want to use the Memento Tuxedo Black. After it dries, it will not smear and smudge, and the alcohol will not bleed into it or cause the muddying. Let me show you a couple things with this product. Both of these have the linen pad which means that when you stamp, you need to tap, 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 rub, rub, rub to get a good amount of ink on. Now I'm going to stamp this image. I'm going to let it dry for a minute, and then I will show you the alcohol ink on it. Over here, you have your stays on, and you will notice with your stays on, you have this clear plastic cover. Do not throw this out. It's very important that you keep that on your ink because it's a solvent-based ink, it evaporates. And if you do not use this, your ink will evaporate and when you go to use your ink pad, it will be dried out. That can be fixed because Stazon does sell refills for your ink. And so does Memento. I'm gonna put a little bit of this. I'm going to stamp this. Now what I'm going to do, first I'm going to show you what would happen if I tried to use one of my old alcohol markers on this. Can you see what's happening? When you run the alcohol marker over the stays on solvent ink, it smears. Not only will it ruin your card, but it will ruin your marker because you will get the black ink all over your marker. So very important, no alcohol with stays on. Instead, you would use your water-based markers, which we could easily color this card and you can see that the ink is not smearing at all with the water-based marker. Just color a little more in. A bit sloppy and outside the lines, but that gives you the idea. See, smearing, no smearing. Now on the Memento, this is perfect for using alcohol markers. I can easily, should have picked the lighter shade to demonstrate this. Yes, I'm going to we're going to have a yellow strawberry. So you can actually see that it 
what happens. See? Coloring right over that strawberry. And this time, there's no smearing because the alcohol markers are designed to work with the memento. They do not work with the solvent-based ink because they melt together. And that's when you would use these. Memento with alcohol markers stays on with water-based markers, stays on for projects that you want, like stamping on window sheets, stamping on tiles, you can stamp on glass, and other surfaces with this. Both of these come with ink refills, so you can keep refilling them as necessary, and they're both great versatile products to add to your ink collection. That's today's quick tip. Thank you and happy stamping.